Hi, it's Mike from Gromax Water. I want to show you now how to change out the membranes on our Gromax Water reverse osmosis systems for hydroponics and gardening. We have the Power Grow 500, which has one membrane. Mega Grow 1000 has two membranes, and the Max Aquarium 00 PPM has one membrane also. The life of your membrane is going to depend on various factors, like the quality of your water coming in, and also the maintenance you do changing out your filters on your units. Reverse osmosis membranes designed to give about 90 to 95% rejection of the contaminants. So if you have 500 ppm or EC coming in, you'll have about 50 coming out. When the quality gets down to about 75% rejection, you might want to think about changing out your membrane then, but that depends on your individual usage and uh, your individual needs for your plants and gardens. Okay? First thing you always want to do is turn off the water. This releases the pressure and make sure you don't get wet. Then you want to disconnect the orange tube to the membrane housing, like this. Take out your membrane housing. It's going to be a little tight. You want to unscrew it like this. Take some long nose pliers. Pull out your membrane like this. Take your new one, put it in, O-rings down first, another seal here, push it in all the way, make sure you get it all the way in, all the way down, okay, close it back up. Connect. Connect your tubing one more time, and you're set to go. Pretty easy to change out the membranes on all of our units. Grow Max Water also offers some optional accessories to improve, improve your installation deionization post filter kits, UV kits, uh, booster pump kits for low pressure, and also float valve kits so when you connect up into a larger. Uh, holding tank. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching and grow it to the max with Grow Max Water.